you know, the EUC, electric unicycle, is a very unique form of vehicle. It's a simplicity of the vehicle. You know, you cannot have uh, less than one wheel to make a vehicle, right? So the EUC only have one wheel and a very portable. And the motion is known for its uh, safety and quality. I'm Bob. Uh, I'm a I'm a founder of Emotion. Of, uh, like ten years ago, we started this company uh, uh, from our campus. So six of our alumni we created this company. When we compare the electric unicycle to the scooter, motorcycle, e-bike, or cars, the first thing you notice is uh, the size. It's a uh, very small. Essentially, it's just a wheel. You put it in the back trunk of your car, you put it underneath your desk, you put it under the table of it in the restaurant, and a lot of our riders, they put it on the trolley car in the supermarket. So you can put it everywhere. It's very convenient. That's the biggest advantage of this device. And uh, also, you know, because of the simplicity of this form, the energy consuming rate is uh, pretty low, very, very low. And uh, have a lot of fun. I'm Cecily, I'm from uh, Emotion Marketing Team. I think uh, once people know how to how to ride a unicycle, they will uh, they will like it. It's just like uh, the wheel can read your mind. You lean forward, it's x rays You lean backward, it's bricks. You know, a lot of our riders tells me the wheel helps them with their mental health. The especially in the pandemic, you know, uh, it's a uh, a lot of people get depressed. So the got a chance to learn the EUC and they can ride it. They don't think anything, it's just the, the rider and the wheel, forget everything. All the, the depressions, uh, unhappy things, it's gone. EUC, a lot of people do group ride. They meet new friends, they have their own community, they are more social connected. So that's basically the good things of the EUC. The, first thing you saw in UC might be it's dangerous, it's hard to learn, it's very strange riding position. So the biggest barrier for the EUC, you know, is a people thought it's not safe. And uh, it's an intuitive thought. So when we make the EUC, we were trying to make it safe. So it's against the people's intuitive thoughts. But it's very hard, you know, it's a self-balancing device. Right now, our latest version is the Emotion V13. It's the max speed can go to uh, 90 uh, kilometers per hour. So it can be very dangerous if the, we do anything wrong. You know, the, the controller, the battery, BMS, the motor, the whole, you know, the structure of the wheel. It should be strong and safe. Probably we had the biggest engineering team in this industry. So that ensures us to make the uh, best wheels in terms of safety and quality. So the first thing we should pay attention uh, is a battery. You know, a battery can be very dangerous, can catch fires. It's a, uh, if you were, uh, BMS is not good enough. Right? The waterproofing is not good enough. It's easy to catch fire and it will be a disaster. It will burn houses down. So that's the first thing we should pay attention to. So all emotion scooters and unicycles, the battery, we have IP67, IP rating. It's the best IP rating in those, in our categories. So this is the first one. And also, you know, for uh, the BMS, we have smart BMS. Our controllers can monitor every cell status on app. app any wrong goes for the cells, 
the controller will now and shut it down immediately and prevent the potential accidents. We have our hardware uh, uh, engineers, we have our firmware uh, uh, engineers. So it's good to have both of the teams. You know, uh, a lot of times their, their work is uh, uh, coordination is uh, very tight. Because we have uh, a, a whole team together, so and uh, we have a lot of riders in emotion, and uh, every every time we do some testing and uh, find some bugs or something, go back to the office and to improve it immediately. Either it's a firmware or a PCB hardware issues. To me, I think the biggest problem is uh, the quality control uh, capabilities from the manufacturers, it's especially for the performance scooters. I'm proud of uh, our team. We have a dedicated team. We love our products. We love riding. And uh, we care the rider's safety. In, on one hand, we need to make it a, a super uh, passionate, super ex exciting. In other times, it should be safe enough. Nine years ago, it's uh, 2014, I guess. Mm, we uh, uh, have our mini segue. As the first batch, we found out there is a potential failure in the battery. So we have sent out like uh, thousands of thousands of units out to consumers. And then we find out their potential um, problem. It's my uh, catch fire. And uh, we need to do it quick. Um, so we need to decide how should we handle it. It's a recall. We cannot even contact to the consumers. So it's a very stressful. We uh, cooperate with our dealers in our app, our website, and uh, in the forum, the social media, a lot of platform. We try to um, get their attentions. So uh, within three months, we record uh, 90% of the of the units we, we sold. So it uh, makes the company almost go out of business. Today, I'm very glad to meet Max Blinker. They have very good customer service. It impressed me a lot. So if you guys want to buy Emotion unicycles or scooters, it's a very good choice to purchase from them.